Okie dokie everyone, Nova back and let's continue. Yep, now we get to fight the boss of the area. Uh, first though, uh, I think I missed like a chunk of map. Ah, almost got it. There we go. So, yeah, just gonna grab that. Right here, these guys are, uh, the boss from the clock tower of the first castle. Back as regular enemies. However, they still have the same uh, fatal programming flaw where they basically just bounce backwards if you hit them. Like that. Rendering them pretty useless. Oh, and I just knocked that one off screen. Alrighty. Right where we fought Old Rocks last time. A shuriken right there. Through this door is uh, Akhmadin the second, I believe. There he is. Yep. Of course, like most of the bosses, he's quite a pushover. I mean, look at him, he's not really doing anything. And he's down. Yep. That was it. Sadly enough. And now he disintegrates. And we get another body part, the Rib of Vlad. Perfect, we are on our way. Down this hallway, we get our other prize, which is uh, simply a heart max up. And so now that that's covered, uh, we finished Deathwing's Lair, and we can move on now. Let's uh, get this map. All right. Now, uh, I have a question for you guys. For those of you who know, there is a weapon in this game, the Crusagrim, which undoubtedly makes it in, uh, incredibly easy because this weapon just, it just owns everything. So, my question to you guys, if you know what the Crusagrim is and uh, its effects, is should I play with it? Because if I have it, I can uh, do things quickly. I can just, I can power through, I can show you guys all the maps, stuff like that. So. Do you want me to play with that and make it easy for me? Or uh, should I keep it, you know, at least somewhat challenging and uh, play with other weapons? Because, um, well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get it anyway to show people and, uh, you know, just for myself. But would you guys want me to play with that or not? So uh, answer in the comments, please, and I will, uh, I will tally it up and see what I will do. Because I really, I could finish the game very easily with the Crusagrum. Ooh, those are very real spikes. Do not want to be landing there. Got a couple of these guys right here. Come on, where's the other one? I saw you hiding over there. Eh, maybe not. Alright. Up this hole. Ooh, picking up items, of course. Mana Prism. Not a great item, but oh well. No! Oh, I hate when that happens. Alright, two items right here. A shield potion and a luck potion. Alright, let's go up. Mm, I said let's go up. Ah, uh, that's what I get for not playing for a few days. I'm just horribly out of practice. Oh no! Okay, save myself that time. Anyways, again, uh, another portal here that I'm just going to unlock so uh, we can move around quickly later if we need to come back. And uh, let's move towards the Colosseum now. Right through here. Meet some uh, interesting monsters. Ah, no. Do not knock me off screen. Oh, thank you. That guy always knocks me off screen over here. 
And then uh, I have to come back and he knocks me off again. And it is a vicious cycle, so... I'm glad that didn't happen that time. Ooh. Another level up! Because, like I said, uh, when you first get here, the monsters give you a ton of experience just because of the big uh, level gap. Over here, let's cover all the map. Money. Let's kill this guy right here. Come on. Eh, or not. But, um, uh, let's open this wall that, you know, was here the first time and is still here. And, uh, yay, we get monsters. But, uh, don't worry, it's not only that. Oh, no, 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 no. Do not knock me back. I will kill you. <sighs> I hate those guys simply because they're ginormous and they fill up the screen and then they send these, like, Huge ass balls of dark magic or whatever. But anyways, got our three items. Worth the little uh, battle to get over here. And uh, on to the Colosseum, where we will face yet another. Oops, that's not the right way. This way. Ooh, ouch. Out of my way. Come on. Well, hey, thanks for knocking me onto the ledge at least. Reverse Colosseum. Werewolves from the first Colosseum. Again, just another boss back as a regular monster. A lot of them here, actually. Ow. Jerk. Die. Ah, somehow I, uh... I'm low on health, so let me just pick up some HP. And the, uh, yeah, we, we have time to cover some map here. Out of my way, stupid dragon. The, the stuff here has a lot of HP and uh, unfortunately I'm not high enough level to uh, do things as quick as I'd like yet. But let's just uh, go along up here and get some items. That is unkillable. And you just can't do anything about it. Uh, sub weapons here yet again. Hop past these. And um, I don't really need that whatever it is over there, that jewel. But yeah, while I'm here, might as well, I guess. Hmm. Let's just try to avoid it. Alrighty. More of them. They're not dangerous, they're just a nuisance. Get out of my way. Come across here. To get... Graham. Um, alright weapon, but I don't play with it. Anyways, I am um, running out of time, so all I'm going to do is uh, pick up the stuff over here and uh, head back to the save point. Oops. So remember guys, uh, the question about the crusade room, use it or not? Uh, let me know. Thanks for watching and I will see you all next time. Toodles!